It is about time that the European Union starts to take youth mental health seriously. Currently, we know that 50% of all mental health struggles, such as anxiety, depression, or more severe conditions, will be established by the age of just 14, and 75% will show up before the age of 24. This added to the fact that the COVID-19 pandemic has been difficult on young people in particular, creates a clear momentum for the European Union to act. Let us not forget that we have had key years stolen from us because of the pandemic, and now, more than ever, we feel its impact. So it is our duty as decision makers to do something about it. And we need to ensure an effective plan to prevent mental health challenges and provide targeted mental health support for young people. But we shouldn't stop here. We must ensure that all young people can actively engage in decisions regarding their mental health and be present when it comes to the decisions made about ourselves. This is why, together with my colleagues within the European Parliament's Committee on Healthcare and the Environment and the other co-chairs of the European Parliament's Mental Health Europe Coalition, I am calling for a European mental health strategy as part of the European Health Union. During this European Mental Health Week, I urge us all to take mental health very seriously, especially our own health. Be kind to yourself and one another, and above all, never be afraid to speak out for mental health.